Hi and welcome to another video on the Montana fifth wheel. Today we're looking at a new Montana high country. This is the 318 RE. One of the first things you'll notice on the high country product is its gray fiberglass exterior. Uh, it's got basically a molded front cap which is pointed and sloped back for aerodynamics and max turn technology. Uh, also has a little hitch vision mirror up front here and an LED light here for nighttime hookup. There's a storage compartment here on the front. You can put a generator in here or house the batteries. Uh, also has the brain box for the wireless remote control system up here as well. It has electric front jacks with the quick pull pins. It also has an electric awning. This electric awning also works off the wireless remote control system. Got a nice security light up here. Two outdoor speakers. Porch light up above the door there. We've got nice upgraded slam latch baggage doors. Has the shocks on these side doors here. But it's an upgraded lock system. Also has TV hookups out here in the basement area. The TV in the bedroom slides off and mounts out here. That TV is also 12 volt, so you don't actually have to have electricity. If you stop at a rest area or something, you can actually watch TV up in the bedroom just off battery power. It has deep tent safety glass windows. They're black framed instead of the cheaper white frames. Has upgraded aluminum wheels, 16 inch tires, also has the Moride CRE 3000 axle suspension, giving it a softer ride. They mount the spare tire underneath the bottom, has the fully enclosed underbelly. Got a 30 inch wide entry door, radius top so it doesn't tear through the awning. This unit has electric rear jacks. These also work off the wireless remote control system. Got a rear ladder on the back. Also notice nice arched crowned roof for water runoff. This unit's 50 amp service. It can have a second air conditioner installed on it or washer dryer hookups as well. Also notice it's got backup lights. Not a lot of fifth wheels have backup lights on them. On the back corner back here, you can fill your fresh water tank or you can fill it from the docking station, which we'll get to here in a minute. The stove exhaust out here, if you're doing any cooking, you have a 10 gallon gas electric water heater. A furnace, refrigerator access panels for maintenance. Another security light on this side as well too. Um, dump station down here as well. One of the dump handles on the 318 is actually right here coming out of the frame side. And then they do two more dump handles here in the docking station. You got your low point water drains, battery disconnect, cable and satellite hookups, outside shower, uh, winterizing valves, black tank valves. Um, also have the uh, bypassing and uh, water pump kit system here as well too. And right up here you have your electric jack button and your front electric jack button as well too. The Montana High Country line is actually a lighter weight fifth wheel compared to its big brothers, the regular Montana and the Big Sky. All the High Country products come in less than 10,000 pounds. Makes it a little uh, easier to tow. This camper here actually is uh, 9,080 pounds dry has a carrying capacity of 2,855 pounds. This unit's equipped with the four-door refrigerator and freezer. A 
We have the optional freestanding dinette with four chairs. Also has a uh, extension on the end there. Has two swivel rocker recliners. 40 inch flat screen TV. Optional electric fireplace. Stereo system is also a DVD player. Has the optional high back desk chair. Got the ceiling fan. Also notice a nice arched roof in here. Nice cabinets in the High Country product. Like the blinds as well. Have a queen air bed, uh, high to bed sofa here with the drawer in the bottom of it as well for extra storage. Got the upgraded uh, 22 inch oven, three burner stove top, electric microwave. Also have the pull out sprayer faucet as well, and the stainless sink. There's also a fantastic fan up here as well in the kitchen area, has the rain sensor and everything also. Got a nice little coat closet area here when you first walk in. Hang your coats and stuff up. Have a hidden control panel here. Has your slide out buttons, power awning buttons, water heater, gas electric buttons, porch lights, scare lights. Also your monitor panel, everything all built in right here as well. Walking up into the main bathroom area here. On the right hand side you've got the fantastic fan controls, a digital thermostat for the air conditioning system, ceiling fan switch. Got a nice glassed in shower tub here. Also has the skylight up above as well too. Nice little toilet room here. Foot flush porcelain toilet. Now the little place to hang stuff. Got your fan up here as well too. Medicine cabinet. Sink and everything here. The High Country is equipped with a queen size bed on the slide out system here. Also have the TV antenna handle up here as well. And another roof vent or you can uh, put a second air. It's already pre-wired for that. Storage underneath the queen bed also. Nice little dresser area here. Little 19 inch flat screen TV. And it, again it is 12 volt. So you don't have to have electric as long as you got a battery. Washer dryer hookups here. These shelves actually just come out. Uh, if you want to do the washer dryer combo. Nice drawer down below. Nice little closet area here. It's got a light electric outlet in it as well. Sliding glass mirrored doors. Also have an actual wood sliding door here to close off your bedroom for privacy in case you have guests. Again, this has been a, another video on the Montana High Country, the 318RE.